where the Gambia government would be paying Senegalese government for watching Senegalese television. Yes. I remember those days when World Cup, we had to stand at somebody's window to peek through to see the World Cup in black and white, Senegalese television. So then they brought this professor, and he said that uh, Gambia didn't need a TV. We are better off paying to Senegal, and uh, it will need 20 years before. When I took over, I said, we will have a TV immediately. I remember in those days we were suspended also from the World Bank and IMF. And the World Bank and the IMF made a big mistake. They sent a delegation to advise me against the TV, building the TV. I looked at the guy and said, are you well? He said, yes, I'm well. I said, no, you are not. At that time, I think there was this war in Kosovo, Yugoslavia. Said, do you know what is going on in Yugoslavia? He said, yes. I said, were you there? He said, no. I said, how do you know? He said, Oh, I watch television. I said, was it important that you are a World Bank guy to know what is going on? He said, oh, yes, it's very educated. He said, so you think that Gambians are stones that they shouldn't know what is going on? He said, well, nobody is supporting you at the moment, and so it will, it will not be prudent. You may not be able to take... Uh, te the television project is an, a huge undertaking, and I think you need to leave that aside. I thought, okay. You are not giving us money, yes. So why are you here to advise me? Because you are, I told you you are very dishonest. And then they started looking at each other. In those days, I used to wear a jacket. One, what Gambians did you know that inside is a plastic tubing where you put water. So when it, you stay in a hot area, it's cool inside. Then I put the air conditions off. And I took my time to lecture there. I said, if you are honest, you have no relationship with us. And then you use taxpayers' money from uh, World Bank money to be paid by them only to come and tell me that I shouldn't, I shouldn't build a, a, a television station. Next time you set foot here, I will lock you up. He said, no, sir, we are World Bank. I said, so what? You are World Bank and I am Gambia Bank. You've come to the wrong place. <laughs> and I told him, let me also tell you, if you think we are not going to pay salary, you make a grave mistake. The World Bank will give me the money. And then they looked at each other and I said, no, not the World Bank that you know. My World Bank is the Almighty Allah, and he will give me to build. And I build this country to a point where one day you come and make it a case study, and this is what is happening now. <laughs> so I think I, I looked at them and I saw that they were very depressed, and I said, in fact, you know what? We are also going to have a university in four years from now. Univers Did you say university? I said yes. In the Gambia, he said yes. He said, oh, Mr. Chairman, we beg. I said, oh, you, when you beg, when you beg that we shouldn't do it, it means that you don't want progress for this country. Uh, today, the university is a reality. Thank God. In fact, they were saying, and I don't know whether you heard that, that, oh, a certificate, they, they didn't say a degree from the U, uh, university extension program. They say any certificate from that would be as good as toilet paper. That was what they said. But I'm happy that nobody who graduated either from the UEP or the UTG, his qualification is being questioned. Nowhere. <laughs> and so, this is what it should be. A university that gives us dignity, in fact, good governance. 400 years, they gave us in, uh, chicken change independence. And then Mickey Mouse government turned a former poultry complex into a teacher's training college called Yundum College. That's not what I want for the Gambians. I want to make sure that any child born be it to a beggar family or whatever, can say, can become anything good in this country. That is what leadership is all about. So, by the grace of the Almighty Allah, we work quickly on this and uh, the, uh, the tender documents, as well as working on the, uh, we'll have to discuss with the uh, works and the finance and SG, how we finance the rest of the completion of the other part. But it has to be an integral part of the, co uh, the, the 
the, the project so that as soon as it, the university is operational, the university teaching hospital is already there. And so once again, thank you very much. And uh, we look forward to a very long and fruitful relationship. Thank you very much.